What's up YouTube, I'm Josh Newland and in this video I'm going to be reviewing the Soccer Bee GPS Tracker for soccer players. I'm do a full review, unboxing, showing you guys all the features and how it works. First and foremost, thank you to Soccer Bee, they sent me this um, GPS tracker in the pod for free. You know, doing this review, I never had a GPS tracker or anything like that before. So I'm really interested to see how it works and all of that and inform you guys about it. Just a quick summary before I get into some of the details. Soccer Bee is a company based in South Korea. You know, their, their product is GPS tracker, comes with a pod. And if you don't know about GPS trackers, it's becoming a new big thing in football or soccer. Um, you know, you wear it in a game or at practice sessions and it tracks, you know, how far you've ran. It can track a lot of specific things about sprints. Um, you can have heat maps of where you are in the field, things like that. So just another very interesting scientific way to track the work you're putting in. Soccer be specifically, you know, when you purchase it, it comes with a pod, comes with a, the vest to wear. And they have their own app. So you download the app and that's how you can see all the data and stats that you want to see um, after using it. So I'm going to show you guys um, just the unboxing of it and also the specific features and just how it really works and then I'm going to come back again after that and I'll talk to you guys again. Alright so first of this review I'm going to start with the unboxing. So it came in this cardboard box and then as you can see UB's lab and soccerbee.com. So I'm going to do this the easy way. Use some scissors. All right, there we go. Okay, so here's what the monitor and I'm guessing the pod and the bra thing you use to wear it are in here. A lot of bubble wrap. So here it is, Soccer B pod. Um, just a zipper right here to open it. Pretty, pretty professional, clean packaging. Seeing silver. Um, waterproof pack. The actual, what you wear to hold it in. Oh, that's really cool. You got numbers, so you can put your number on there. That's that's pretty cool. This is the. Um, Thing everything was in it says 22 players chase the ball for 90 minutes and at the end those who have soccer be win so open up these things right now too this is like bubble wrap with silver reflective stuff on the outside sort of it's pretty interesting and then yep there it is what it's all about a little pod stick it in the back um, and that's what you see when the pros, they have a little, looks like they have a little bump coming out of their back. That's from these things. And a little charger cord. Here's what you actually wear to hold it in place. Looks like a sports bra. It's got the soccer bee on the front. Another little logo on the back. And then this is the pocket where you put the pod on the back. So, yeah, that pod's not really getting banged around at all in there. It feels secure. Um, it's a large. We'll have to see how this fits on me. But yeah, that's everything opened up. We got pod. It comes in. Charger cord. And add some numbers to it, which I will definitely put my number on there. And then also this waterproof pack. Okay, so this, you put the pod in here, and then you put it in the... The bra, sorry, I don't know what else to call it, that you wear. And this will keep it waterproof. So this is just describing how it works. So I'll definitely be using this because I sweat a lot. So that's pretty much everything unpacked. Really looking forward to using it tomorrow in our scrimmage and seeing some of my stats, things I've never seen before because I've never used a GPS monitor or anything like that in any of my games before. So I'm really interested and can't wait to review it fully for you guys. So when it comes how to use the soccer B pod, you can see here you just hold down the, the button until the green dot comes on. 
I put it in this waterproof pack here, um, seals it tight. Once you have that put together, then you put that into the pocket in the back of the vest, as you can see. And it fits pretty snug in there, so there's no way that's coming out during the game, no matter how hard you're running or any of that. It does feel a little weird. Um, it fits fine. It doesn't feel tight. It doesn't feel too loose. You know, when you're first starting out to wear it, you, know, you can notice it a little bit. It feels a little bit strange. But after playing for a little while, you know, you, you forget it's there, really and it fits great you know, like I said it doesn't move around much um, whether you're jogging sprinting jumping any of that it stays in place but it's not bothering you either and on this day you know I just did some different conditioning drills and some simple ball control stuff and again as you can see you know chesting it with um, the ball as well isn't messing it up you know going up for headers in the air um, you know, it stays in place it stays where it's supposed to be and then you know once you're done you just take it back out of the vest out of the little pack and you hold down the button again uh, until it shuts off and then you're ready to after you're, you're done with your session you get back to your room you get back home you can sync it up to your phone and that's where you see all the data from your session so once your session or game is over you have the app installed you just open up the app um, you go to the main button in the bottom middle and then um, use Bluetooth to connect to your pod and to sync it to your phone. And this is when it will start syncing the data. It will take a few minutes, but then you will be able to see all of your stats and data from that session. And once it syncs, it will ask for your position that you're playing, also the time you're playing. And it shows you know the times where you were idle, like uh, halftime or if you got subbed out. I played about 70 minutes this game. So I just selected the two different halves um, where I was actually running, moving around. So this is a screen that you see when you need to set up all the specifics about your session, the total duration, the number of sessions, which would be, you know, like halves or periods, um, the exact time of day um, that you played, and also your position. Then you can also set the analysis area to match, you know, the field, the pitch that you played on. And the system uses a GPS, so you just uh, draw out the borders of the pitch with your finger. You know, you have to have a name for the field. Then you just save that. And once you have all that data right, then you can hit the analysis button, and then it will show you all of the precise stats now that you've put in that information. So you just wait a few seconds, and then you get the best part. You get the information, the data, um, your total distance ran, highest speed, number of sprints, the coverage, how much of the field you covered, your average speed, and your total sprint distance as well. And my favorite part is that if you use your finger and slide with that thing on the bottom, you know it will show you where you were on the field. And they have heat maps here as well. And it will give you, you know, a certain number of stars out of five. So that way you can compare. You can compare yourself to past games. You can compare yourself to other players on your team if they're also using Soccer B and you guys have set it up on the same team on the app so it's great to compare um, your work rate compared to other games and to other players on your own team and once you're done looking at it you send that data to the team schedule so that way that data is attached to a specific game so you remember um, where all those stats are from so I was unboxing showing you guys the features how it works in the app and the data I actually collected from one of my own games and I really enjoyed using it like I said I've never had a GPS tracker before but it's just really interesting seeing, I mean, you can see exactly where you are in the field, um, you know, throughout the game and lots of other specific stats. It's really interesting to see when I've never had anything like that before to really see the data and to see some of the science behind it. You know, it's also something you can use, you know, with your teammates or if you're a coach, you can implement it with your team and you can impair players. I think it's just another way that football is trending to the next level. Again and again with new technology like this, you know, I really enjoy using it and I definitely plan on keeping to use it um, for future games and probably training sessions as well. It's easy to use. It's a great working product. So thank you Soccerbee for reaching out, sending me this for free. Um, this concludes, you know, my review, the Soccerbee Pod Soccer Football GPS Tracker. I recommend it. To any of you guys out there that 
want to know the stats, you know, playing in games, things like that. It's interesting, it's useful, and some of the new technology that is just pushing the game forward. So thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. If you do, please hit that like button. I'll subscribe if you like this kind of content. And let me know in the comments, do you want to see me do more product reviews? You know, as time goes on, I've been using more different brands, um, boots, cleats, balls, all kinds of different products for this sport. So let me know if you want me to review some of those things, give me, give you guys my thoughts on those. Just drop that in the comments. Thank you again for your support. God bless you all. I'll see you in the next vid.